Hey everyone, Zeph here and welcome to the American Dream Overview. This may be one of those videos that I have a lot to say before even trying out the game. Like, <laughs> I, I don't get political on my channel and stuff like that. But when I first saw this trailer, I was like, wow, this is actually coming to quest. That's crazy. <laughs> so the American Dream is a satirical take on the overall gun culture and simulates the life how it would be if you'd use pistol and rifles for common daily tasks. Let's start with the mechanics first. It seems like a rail on shooter where we complete certain objectives according to the narration, kind of like a job simulatory gameplay. The graphics don't seem crazy but it's supposed to be a comedic approach. In terms of its humor it might be something similar to Simon Max but the biggest problem I have with it is with its theme. Satire and actual offensive stuff is a very thin line and I'm very curious how the developers handle that if the stuff they will present will be lighthearted and actually funny then it's gonna be all good but with its current climate cancel culture everything that's actually happening in America currently with shootings it might not just be the right time to release it seeing it's a four year old of a PC VR game it might have been fine then but it's curious to see how it's gonna be perceived now <laughs> I'm gonna try to focus on the gameplay because that's my job here I could care less about politics even though I should but I'm just not that type of person this is just my first thoughts when I saw the trailer let's just say it's just interesting it passed the creation system of meta knowing its history of censorship and stuff like that like they seem to pick and choose stuff so I'm hopeful that GTA will actually be the actual game we all know and love but that's besides the point now let's go to the gameplay <laughs> that's a start well I appreciate there are subtitles every game should ago in the summer of 1949, a group of nine respected companies came together to craft a vision of the future of America. They should float around. They set upon themselves one key question. What makes America great? Is it the sweat of our brows? No. Is it the beautiful land upon which we built our homes? No. It is the ability for any man to achieve whatever he sets out to do using the tools of his great nation. Welcome to the American Dream. My name is Buddy Washington and I will be your guide. We'll be going on a trip through time to discover the magnificent future that lies ahead with you and your guns. Soon you'll learn just how guns will be able to help you live life to the fullest. And as a special treat at the end of your tour, you'll get a sneak peek into the wondrous gun factory of tomorrow. We began with humble gunsmiths toiling away in their workshops. But a much grander future is in store for us. Press the green button in front of you, and we'll continue onward. <laughs> it's not loaded yet. Please keep your guns in the cart at all times, have fun. <laughs> what? A background check to gauge your eligibility to participate in the American Dream. Please select your gender. Select your skin tone. <laughs> Have you handled a firearm before? Uh, does VR count? Yeah, sure. Have you been convicted for any serious criminal offenses? Not yet. Which is your dominant hand? Are you currently on any terrorist watch lists? Who knows? Also, a word of warning. Please be aware of your surroundings while you experience the ride. You'll be waving your hands around a lot. So best not to play next to an ancient Ming vase or a full coffee pot. We want you to have a safe and fun journey. Please enjoy this brief introductory video. Oh God. Ah, the home. The busy centerpiece of American life. 
It's where you'll find a diligent wife <laughs> tending to her family's needs. Take a peek inside, and you Ew. might find her preparing her husband's favorite meal. Well done, gun is ruined. Caring for their beautiful child. <laughs> Why she has fingers on the trigger? Extra time to make sure everything's nice and clean. Oh my god. Wow, the effects. Husband is hard at work providing for his family. Whether he spends his days as a blue collar worker in a bagel factory, nice green screen, or a young corporate manager on the rise, it's his job to bring home the bacon. On the weekends, husband does his part around the house as well, managing finances. Tending to the garden. And then finally settling down for some well-earned R&R. And a delicious home-cooked meal. Is this supposed to be funny? Press the green button in front of you to begin your journey. Like, it's not all about guns anymore. It's just the humor level is so low comparing to everything I've tried. Maybe I'm getting older, I don't know. <laughs> you may have noticed that you're carrying a pair of Carter 1912 single action semi-automatic pistols. From the battlefield to your back pocket, the Carter 1912 will be the tool of choice for all your everyday needs. The ice. Let's see how the baby of tomorrow will learn how to use their very first gun. Before you can use the gun, you'll have to load it. Move your right gun across onto the magazine. That's it! Nothing like the sweet sound of a magazine sliding into the gun. Now do the same with your left gun. Great job! You're now armed and ready. Baby's hungry. We need to let mommy know. Knock on the door a few times to get her attention. You did it! Mommy's here and look what she has. A gun? <laughs> Open wide for the airplane. Ew, no, 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 excuse me. <laughs> Eat the food. You know, with your mouth. Yum, yum. Scrumbridge Farms Cold Press Coagulated Baby Feed is made from 90% high fructose corn syrup and 20% horse meat that tastes of freedom in every bite. Baby's gonna grow up big and strong in no time. Now it's time for a little quiz. We want to make sure baby is well educated as well as being a good shot. Excellent. <laughs> You're reloading like a champion now. It's not smooth though. Which one of these is the triangle. You got it. Which one of these is the color red? <laughs> What does two plus two equal? Sometimes it is five, 
Sometimes it is three. Sometimes it is all of them at once. You must try harder. It is not easy to become sane. Try again. <laughs> what? Good job, kiddo. Which one is your favorite animal? <laughs> Interesting choice. How many bullets are there in a standard Carter 1912 magazine? Eight. You got it. Who is your best friend? Excellent choice, my friend. Now let's learn how to aim our guns with a bit of target practice. A gun without aim is a dangerous thing. So make sure you know what you're shooting at. Shoot down each of the targets. Well, at least it works properly. That's fun. I mean, not the game, but this. <laughs> Ducklings are so cute. You should shoot them. My trembling hand does not help. By the way, did you know you can also manually eject your magazines? Perfect for when you want full control over when to reload. To eject your magazine, press the highlighted button on your controller. That's the way I can already tell nice. the baby's going to grow up to be a star soldier. You've now mastered the use of your trusty pistols. Remember to handle with care and use them responsibly. Safety first, kiddo. Now I know it's fun being a baby. But you'll only fit those divers for so long. Let's move on! Get money? Press the green button and let's continue our journey. Uh, the question is, do I want to? <laughs> Maybe I'll see two minutes of the next stage. Like, it's too slow. The subtitle should float with you by just today's VR standards. The graphics are cartoony but basic. I don't know. I'm bored. So far. <laughs> No, <laughs> I just don't see anyone playing it seriously. I mean, satire and stuff. But it's not even funny, funny level of comedy. It might be because the game is pretty old by now. And before when VR was just barely introduced, it could be fun. But in 2022, I don't see it. Like, kudos to get into the official store, though. There are just better things to do with due respect to the developers. If you want to make it better, floating subtitles, more polished stuff. But then again, I don't see it getting updates or anything more from what we're getting so it is what it is i suppose